Welcome to Royal News Updates. ONG Fatherhood to End Forever, Prince Charles Angry by Harry and Sussexes after Royal Rift and Memoir. Before we start, please, subscribe to my channel and click the bell icon, thanks. Prince Charles has resumed, talking with Prince Harry but the Duke of Sussex has been advised not to expect any grand gesture from the royal family as it does not match the way they operate. Prince Charles is known to have a deep love for his sons but he is now trying to heal the relationship with Prince Harry after a rough patch. Royal editor Rebecca English claimed the firm wants Prince Harry to visit his home in the UK and to spend some precious time with the Prince of Wales. However, she noted no grand gesture is likely to come from Charles due to the nature of the royal family, and its way of operating. Ms English told Palace Confidential, the Prince of Wales does really love his son and yes, there is a dialogue going on there between them and, of course, the hope is that one day they will be able to repair their relationship. But the royal family is just not kind of prone to these grand gestures. That said I think probably, they do want Harry to eventually be able to come to the UK and spend some quality time with his father. But of course, it all depends I think slightly on how things go over the next few weeks regarding the judicial review he's seeking from the Home Office about his security. And of course, there is that kind of lurking bombshell of his memoir that's due to come out later this year. Prince Charles reportedly extended an olive branch to Prince Harry asking him to stay at his home due to increased security concerns on his visit to the UK. The Prince of Wales also praised the Duke of Sussex for his environmentalist efforts in his recent essay about climate change for US magazine Newsweek. He wrote, As a father, I am proud that my sons have recognized this threat. Most recently, my elder son, William, launched the prestigious Earthshock Prize to incentivize change and help repair our planet over the next 10 years. On Harry, he added, my younger son, Harry, has passionately highlighted the impact of climate change, especially in relation to Africa, and committed his charity to being net zero. Royal correspondent, Jack Royston said, Prince Charles giving Prince Harry credit for his work on climate change shows he does not want Oprah to be the end of their relationship. A lot has happened between them and it must have been very hard for the Prince of Wales to hear some of the things his second son has been saying about him publicly. From total neglect to genetic pain to my family literally cut me off financially, Harry gave his father both barrels in 2021. However, the point when Charles becomes king is nearing. Such clear and public praise for Harry shows he wants to move past the acrimony and look to the future, not the past. He added, the Queen twice recently praised the contributions of different members of the royal family to the fight against climate change without mentioning Harry. Charles, clearly, feels more comfortable ensuring his son gets the credit for the work he has done and is not forgotten, in spite of everything. Thanks for watching, please, share your thoughts in the comment. Thanks.